the video lecture series of hand embroidery which has been developed for the vocational course for class 9th and class 10th this video will give an overview of the content of the textbook for class 9th and class 10th published by the national council of educational research and training for the job role hand embroidery hand embroidery is one of the main job roles in the apparel made ups and home furnishing sector for which this vocational education subject is introduced in schools this vocational education subject is to be studied along with the general education subjects offered in schools you must have seen embroideries on your garments bed sheets pillow covers and other products these embroideries help make the garment or product appear aesthetically pleasing to the eyes the strands of embroidery on garment or other products add texture design to the base fabric or other material embroidery specifically hand embroidery is the craft of decorating fabric or other material using a needle and colorful threads by hand apart from needle and thread a variety of material such as beads sequins shells coins etc are used in embroidery why do we need to promote hand embroidery that is a big question in india as we all know the apparel and home furnishing sector is among the fastest growing sectors in the country this sector covers a great number of activities and a very important area of this sector is hand embroidery hence there is a huge demand of trained personnel in this field moreover india has a rich tradition of embroideries with a number of different embroidery styles practiced in different states kashida of kashmir fulkari of punjab chamba rumal of himachal pradesh chicken kari of uttar pradesh kach and katiwari embroideries of gujarat and rajasthan kantha of west bengal kasuti of karnataka all contribute to the rich tradition of hand embroideries of india this course will not only generate employment in the field but also will help promote the legacy of such embroidery traditions so now we come to the question what is hand embroidery hand embroidery as i explained earlier is the beautiful craft of decorating fabric and other materials with the help of a needle and thread the patterns created by hand embroidery are delicate colorful and pleasing use of a variety of stitches adds to the beauty of embroidered designs and patterns every work of hand embroidery is unique to the embroiderer who performs the embroidery as you know the art of applying decorative designs to fabric with a needle is known as embroidery these designs are usually created with thread and are made up of various stitches a hand embroiderer should possess skills to perform various basic and advanced embroidery stitches to enhance the beauty of garments or the products before starting the embroidery work some preparations are needed like starch removal from the fabric to be embroidered ironing the fabric arranging the appropriate thread frame needle and various other material the basic hand embroidery stitches include running stitch stem stitch satin stitch long and short stitch chain stitch lazy daisy stitch and various other stitches the advanced hand embroidery stitches include padded satin threaded back stitch lace running stitch interlace running stitch pekini stitch chevron stitch closed herringbone stitch and others All the embroidery stitches need a lot of hard work and patience to achieve a perfect and well finished look. The students will learn the basic stitches in class 9th and the advanced stitches in class 10th. They can also learn and practice many stitches as per their creativity. This course also explains the basics of hand embroidery including the common embroidery related terms designs and tracing methods the tools and materials used for embroidery defects of embroidery and its remedies this course will help the student learn about organizational rules and personal hygiene organizational hazards safety measures cleaning and maintenance at workplace 
Class 10th textbook of this job role explains the elements and principles of design, emphasizes the advanced hand embroidery stitches. Various traditional Indian hand embroideries are also included in this textbook. This textbook also explains combination of different hand embroidery stitches and application of embroideries including the spec sheet. Finishing and packing of embroidered garments or products which is an important part of this job role is also discussed in the course. This vocational education course includes step-by-step -step procedure of making all the hand embroidered stitches with instructions. A lot of practice will be needed from student's side to get a perfect finished look in the embroidery. On completion of vocational education course of hand embroidery, it is expected that as a student, you should be able to perform the task of decorating fabrics and other materials using hand embroidery. Also, you should be able to procure all the materials required for the embroidery designs and plan, design and execute embroidery designs using different stitches, needles and threads. So, if you develop all the competencies, then you may get employed in various apparel made-ups and home furnishing firms and in organizations involved in such activities. The usual job opportunities after completing the course can be self-employment which includes own setup, freelancing at embroidery units, freelancing at buying house, freelancing at design house, apparel and furnishing. Wage employment may include assistant hand embroiderer at embroidery units, senior hand embroiderer at embroidery units, hand embroiderer in buying houses or agencies, hand embroiderer in export houses, hand embroiderer in design houses which includes apparel and home furnishing, trainer at NGOs. For more details you may contact the address flashed on your screens. Thank you.